October 1st, 2015. Margaret Acton and her dog, Jess, head out on their daily walk. We walk until we get a little away from the house and uh, I let her off and she heads off for a run. She just disappeared out of my view. Then I heard a big splash. I think Jess is having her swim. I walked down the side of the hill and I see a kangaroo in the watering hole. This kangaroo is upset and I remember being told of kangaroos taking dogs and grabbing them and trying to drown them. Instantly I became alarmed. This video taken by a bushwalker captures one of these terrifying encounters. Luring the predator into the water, it's a well-known kangaroo defense. Once the kangaroo is in the water, it's safe. Its height allows it to watch and wait as the dog swims out to meet it. It lets the dog get close and lunges, using all its weight to keep the dog under until it drowns. The kangaroo can stand in quite deep water and the dog can't touch the bottom, at which point they can then grab it and hold it underwater. Margaret Acton is terrified for her dog, Jess. My thought was, well, I'm the only one here that's going to stop that from happening. I'll continue close up and I'll fall to the ground. Suddenly, the kangaroo turns its attack from the dog to Margaret. I went to get up and I was just met with an almighty strike. Knocked me off my feet. If you run into a solid object and you hit something really hard, it felt like that. He makes a guttural growl and I see his ears pricked. I know that he's not going to go away. So I'm starting to think then that I might not get out of this. They might kill me. A sudden noise catches the kangaroo's attention. Jess comes back and starts barking at him again. And that was what saved me, I think.